I'm Dr. JC Lowen. I'm the clinical neuroscientist here at Cognitive FX. So the functional MRI or the FNCI that we do here and treatment isn't for everyone. The standard patient that we treat is an individual that's had a concussive type of injury with the reminder that not all concussions are apparent at the moment. Some patients may develop symptoms days or weeks later and may not get a diagnosis immediately after the head injury or they may have a number of concussions that have added up over time. For these patients, they are displaying certain physical, emotional, visual, cognitive, and other types of symptoms that are very characteristic of PCS or post-concussion syndrome. Now, for the patients that we will turn away, these are usually individuals that are suffering from primary disorders. ADD or ADHD, for example, which is more genetically related. It's something that you may have been born with, and it's something that's not going to be visible on the functional MRI, nor will it really respond to the type of treatment that we do here. The same falls for some specific types of neurodegenerative disorders or others. That being said, if you have a primary neurological condition, ADD or ADHD, depression or otherwise included, and you then suffer a concussion and chronic symptoms afterwards, which exacerbate your pre-existing symptoms, that is something we can work with. Patients at Cognitive FX come in for treatment anywhere from three months after their injury to 50 years after their injury. We typically have amazing results no matter how long ago a patient's injury was. If you have recently received your injury, we like to see patients who have waited at least three months after their concussion for the best results. If it has been three months and your symptoms haven't resolved or are getting worse, please contact us.